Jane Austen was born December 16, 1776 in Steventon, Hampshire. But we have to keep in mind that in her day, the one thing they had to do for their future was to find a young man to marry who could keep them living in the style that they were used to living in. So all of her novels are courtship novels. However, each plot is very different, each heroine is very different, and yet we see certain shared characteristics. For example, the heroine is always on a journey of education in the sense of self-knowledge, learning more about herself, uh, recognizing the major errors of her way. There are six books that Jane Austen is known for, starting with the first, Sense and Sensibility, Pride and Prejudice, Mansfield Park, Emma, Northanger Abbey, and Persuasion. In the following clips, there will be a brief synopsis of each story and the character images from the movies. 1811, Sense and Sensibility. Sense and Sensibility tells the story of two young women named Eleanor and Marianne Dashwood. These women suffered the loss of their father, Henry Dashwood. The estate of Henry Dashwood went to his son, John Dashwood, from a previous marriage. Their mother, their sister Margaret, and themselves moved to the town of Barton to live with distant relatives. Eleanor is sad about leaving because she has become close with Edward Ferrars, who is the brother-in-law of John Dashwood. Marianne meets new people as the story goes on, one of them being Colonel Brandon. New love interests escalate with Marianne as she continues to find herself. Eleanor finds out some interesting information about Edward from a good family friend, Lucy Steele. Eighteen thirteen, Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Prejudice tells the story of a woman named Elizabeth Bennet. Elizabeth, who has always been prejudiced against society, lives with her mother and four sisters, Lydia, Mary, Catherine, and Jane. Jane has always been the prettiest of the family and even received a marriage proposal at 15. Elizabeth's mother is always waiting for the day to marry one of her daughters. When news was heard that a wealthy neighbor has moved into town, Mrs. Bennett is ecstatic. A ball is thrown in Mr. Bingley's honor and we are introduced to Mr. Darcy. Jane and Mr. Bingley are introduced as well as Mr. Darcy and Elizabeth. Elizabeth overhears an interesting comment from Mr. Darcy that changes her mindset into his pride and Mr. Bingley invites Jane to dinner in which she becomes ill. 1814 Mansfield Park Mansfield Park tells the story of a young girl named Franny Price. Fanny is a very shy girl from a poor family. Her sister was able to escape their poor background by marrying into the Bertram family. Miss Price decides to live with her aunt and uncle who run the Bertram's estate. Fanny doesn't care much for the two younger Bertram girls, and the elder boy Tom is often seen drinking heavily. Edmund Bertram, the younger son, is everything that Fanny wants in a man. But when he talks about other girls and his intentions with them, Fanny finds herself in a rough situation, especially when another man comes into the picture. 1816, Emma. Emma tells the story of a 20-year-old girl named Emma Woodhouse. Emma has always loved matching people up and considers herself a matchmaker, after she introduced her governess to a local widower named Mr. Weston. Emma's new friend Harriet Smith comes to town, so she soon decides to match Harriet with Mr. Elton. However, plans change when Harriet receives a proposal from a farmer with which she has fallen in love, and Emma is faced with the connection she has with her brother-in-law, Mr. Knightley. 1818, Northanger Abbey and Persuasion. Northanger Abbey. Northanger Abbey tells the story of a 17-year-old girl named Catherine Moreland. The story is split into two parts and begins with Catherine getting an invitation to attend Bath, which is a resort. Catherine has never been before and is eager to attend. Catherine is then introduced to Henry Tilney, whom she cannot stop thinking about after meeting, 
and Isabella Thorpe, who takes Catherine under her wing in all of Bath's festivities. Persuasion. Persuasion tells the story of a woman named Anne Elliot. Anne comes from a wealthy family and has never been worried about money. Her mother had died 14 years prior and her father had recently become a bit of a spender. Anne has two sisters, Elizabeth and Mary. Mary had recently gotten married to Charles Musgrove. Anne and her family have decided to move due to spending habits and the tenants of their house are the Crofts. Mrs. Croft is the sister of the man Anne was supposed to marry and still isn't over. Captain Wentworth. As Anne goes to visit her sister, she is faced with the inevitable connections between her and Captain Wentworth. Jane Austen died July 18, 1817, shortly before completing Northanger Abbey in Persuasion. She never married and never used her real name in any of her works until after her death. There is no doubt that Jane Austen was a period author. However, she discussed in her books how important it was for women to make a success on their own, making standards for themselves leading into finding the man of their dreams. It was very unheard of for women of her time to be unmarried and supporting themselves. The feminist ideals that were brought about with Jane Austen brought truth to the inevitable beacon of equality.